Welcome to Train Valley 2, the fun game with trains, and if you like to think of them this way, puzzles, but basically scenarios where you have to figure stuff out. Now Train Valley 2 has recently got its full release in Steam, it's come out of early access, and as part of that, the developers added 20 new scenarios to do, which are complicated, shall we say. Challenging is another way of putting it, and so far... I have done three of the new scenarios, Cape Town, The Long Train and Tibet, and the observant of you who saw the last episode will notice that I recorded it, I got four stars, I've been back since and got the fifth star. I did it exactly the same way as I did when I recorded it, I was just more efficient in getting trains moving faster. This time around it's going to be the scenario The Volcano, and normally this is the point I would say I've never seen this before, but I have, because I tried it, was recording it, and it surprised the living daylights out of me. I failed horribly, so I figured, what the heck, I'd work it out. And I actually got to the, almost the end of it when I stopped. So I didn't record, record how well I would have done, but I would have got four stars because it surprised me multiple times. So this is the volcano. I have a good idea of what I'm doing so I can explain it. The briefing is, I've got 18 minutes, I'm not allowed to upgrade trains, and I can't buy more than two. It says more than two, I don't think I'm actually allowed to buy two, so I can buy another train. And this is what it looks like. Okay, so I've got a town here that wants steel slabs and cows. And a town here that wants canned goods. To get canned goods, I need corn, cows, and steel plates. Okay, to make steel slabs, I need iron ore and coal, which are down here. To get corn, I need to put people up there, then transport it down there to get my cattle. I also need to transport it down here to this factory. And I need steel slabs to go over there and people and electricity, which is over there. Which all seems simple enough for the way it's laid out. Until you understand that this is the volcano, and after a couple of minutes, this little bit in the centre will fill with nice hot red lava. Not a problem, it doesn't destroy anything. However, just after the five minute mark, this whole centrepiece will be destroyed with red lava and it will also flow out of here, out of here and out of here. So you have to earn enough money fast enough so that you can destroy all this stuff before it gets destroyed by the lava and reconfigure everything. And then... After eight and a half minutes, I think it is, somewhere around the eight and a half minute mark, so you've got another three and a half minutes, more lava will come out and it will flood this whole centre bit, so one of the alternatives is you will put track around here and it will go around this area, which will then get filled up with lava. Not great, I know, so you have to kind of hurry to get things done. Then after about the... that was a ten minute mark, I think I said that was. Or was that the eight, eight and a half minute? That was the eight and a half minute mark. The ten minute mark, more lava comes flooding out of somewhere. And I think it destroys that bridge and that bridge. Well, you... Hang on. Five minutes destroys that. Eight and a half destroys that. I think the ten minutes destroys those two. And there's another lava eruption about 13 minutes in. Which I can't remember exactly where it goes. But it makes life even more challenging. You'll see what I mean as it as it happens. So, what you have to do is prepare yourself by getting as much done as possible in the first five minutes. I say when I say as much, there's only a limited amount you can do in the first five minutes. Do I want to do it that way? Do I want to do it that way? That way, probably. All right. Yeah, because I want to be able to put that round there, up to there, and I've got just enough money to do that. So the first things, get people digging coal and iron ore. And by using both towns to send people out, this wonderful loop has a bridge in it, which means I don't have to worry about collisions in the centre, which is kind of nice. That's 20 workers on their way. Now 
Now, I only actually need 20 iron ore as well. I'm going to need about 40 coal, which is a bit less wonderful. That's the first train home. You can both go down that way. And I've got a bit of cash, so probably not enough. Right. So now I'll pause it, connect that bit like that, that bit like that. And if I can get to the end of that, thank you. Okay, that's that little lock connected up. Sending trains up this way. They should be out of the way by the time these trains get to where I would need them to go. Hopefully. And I've only currently got four trains. Do not hit the back of that train, I will be upset. really have to keep an eye on the time here. Okay, you lot are all going to get into there. I need to send some more trains out, but I can't for the moment. Because there's going to be a coal train in the way. That noise that just occurred is the hissing noise telling you the volcano is going to do something nasty. Like that. But that is survivable. For now. Okay, let's send out some more trains. But they're going to go up there and up to area. How long have I got? Okay. That should give me enough time to get those guys up there as well. Got to remember to flip a switch when those that passenger train's gone past. One minute left before the lava starts destroying stuff. Come on, good. I might have to slow that train down. In fact, I probably will. That should give me enough. Should get out of there and into there. Oh, I'm gonna have to slow you down again. Come on, I need you out of there. Right. That's all you lot there. I'm not gonna send another train through the middle because I don't have the time. Everybody out the way. Good. Okay, now let me do some destruction. There's nothing else that's a nice money earner.
Alrighty. I need to destroy that bit of track in a second as well. So far, that's got me quite a lot of money. Want to do it that way? Yes, I think I want to do it that way. Well, no, I don't. Let me destroy this bit of track as well. So I can reconstruct it. That's how I want to do that bit. Ah, forgot. I need to build a bridge. I've got all the 20 iron ore I need. There's 10 already in there. So that's the 10 slabs for there. And I'll make 10 slabs for there. So I shouldn't need to connect that in theory. Which is kind of nice. Save me a bit of money. I also need to put a bridge across here. Run that down to there. And this is where it gets fun as far as I'm concerned. Run that to connect like that. I also need to not quite like that. And that like that. I need that connected. That connected. That connected. Okay, start shipping trains out. You're going to the coal place. You're going to go to the cattle. Oh, that was a mistake. I forgot about that coal train. They can come out and go back down there. Ah! What's that horrifying noise? Here comes the lava any second. Yep, literally anything that was in that general direction, I forgot to destroy that bit of track. Which would have been good to use. I've still got two trains going, haven't I? Just let me destroy that because it's distracting. Right, I'm allowed to buy one more train, so I'm going to. Oh, I've stolen destroy. That was silly. Okay. I'm going to send these steel slabs out. Send the steel slabs down this way. Start sending the corn out. Because the more I can do as fast as possible, the better. I want to put too fine a point on it. Okay, that's five trains on the go. One of them gets somewhere. Send out another train. from here as well. You're going to go in there. You're going to go that way. And down to the corn. You're going to go the same way. You're going to go to the cattle place. Okay, no, maybe not. You're going to get there too early to go to the cattle place. So you're going to go to that place. As are you. Gets me another 10 seal steel slabs here. And I've got until the eight and a half minute mark before I start having more problems. That's you lot there, you lot are in there. Okay, steel slabs come out of here and go down to this town. Out of that. 
go to the cattle place. As the steel slabs have made it, I've got maybe a minute. Hopefully, it, ooh, I don't know if that train's going to make it in time or not. However, what I now need to do, because I know the the end is coming, is get some of my money back. Okay, I can't seem to destroy that bit of tile. Not great, but okay. Trying to remember, I, I do need to use this bridge again, I think, at this point, so I'll probably have to reconstruct some of that. that. You should make it to there. Right, now also, I want some electricity. I'm going to want some electricity, to be precise. get that down there I forget right stop yes there's a lot of things I forget as well so I'm not perfect now I need to put a bridge over there a bridge over there Forget how I joined the cattle one up, but I'll figure that out in a second. Right, you go like that. And while I'm here. Like that and that. I can't remember if this bit gets destroyed now or later. But anyway, right, that's everything I think currently connected. I'm not sure when I lose that bridge. I've forgotten how I connect the cattle place up again. Is there a bridge I can put in over there possibly? Or is it a bridge over there? I'll worry about that in a second. Right now, I can get the corn out of there. Do I need more cattle? Yes, I do need more. I need even more corn and cattle, don't I? Well, I can get the corn out of here and into there. Because why not? And... Oh! I can't remember exactly what gets destroyed, but I think it's probably up to about there and it's probably something horrific down this way as well so I'll see where the lava ends up like I say I've done this once so I don't remember everything about what I'm trying to do now I'll get the corn over there okay destroyed that bridge okay okay I thought that bit filled up Oh, did I destroy that with no for no good reason? Apparently I did. Okay, well while I'm here. I'm gonna need more corn at some point. Whoa! Ah, that was my fault. Alright. That has a switch on it. I didn't realise that. That was silly. I 
Okay, now you come out of here and go get me some more coal. How do I get that? Okay, it's not destroying that bit yet. Ah, I think that must get destroyed in the 10 minute mark now. How do I get stuff back from there? It's a good question right now. If I'd remembered when which bits got destroyed when that's distracting. It's about to do something else and I can't remember which bits get destroyed. I think possibly that bridge. But I'm not sure. I want to see what gets destroyed. Yep, that bridge goes. Is that it? Okay, that's it for now. So now Bridge over there. Yes, once you remember where things are actually being destroyed, life becomes a lot easier. If I had a decent memory, life would become a lot easier. That will connect there. Can I actually connect that? No, I can't. Uh, do I have to go this way? I do. Apart from not quite like that. How about like that? Right. Maybe I was worried about it being destroyed too early. But... Get some cattle moving. Oh, dolt. Come on, out of there. Connect that way. No, you're not going to connect. Yeah, you are going to connect. Good. All right, cattle, get moving. And you're going to go all sorts of directions. I destroyed that to up there again. It destroyed that bridge. It would have been. Would have been doable, but... Okay. It's going to get the cattle over there. That's going to have to get out the way. Get these trains moving with this stuff in it. Or the corn. This stuff. I should be able to recognise corn. I've been to Iowa. I should know what corn looks like. Don't hit him. Do not hit him. Good boy. Just missed. Right. You'll get back into the cattle place. And I've got ten corn there. I'll have that. So I need to make electricity, which means I need to get coal over to there. To make electricity. doing wonderfully for time. Something else is going to blow up shortly. Okay, let's slow you down. I really don't need a train collision right now. It would make my day slightly less wonderful. Let's shove some people into there. going that way. Twelve and a half minutes, so I've got five and a half minutes to go. I need to get the cattle out of here down to there, and I also need to get the steel plates built and down to there then the hop from the canned food to there is relatively simple. Okay. 
here comes some more lava. I'm not entirely sure what it's going to destroy, but it's probably not going to be good. Yeah. Okay, that. Okay, it's the 13 minute mark where it destroys that bit of track in there. So I could have used that, but I failed on that point. Okay, you could come out of there and go to the same place. Send some more people that way. Mistake. Oh, where the heck did I just go back? I'm making mistakes now. This is what happens when I start worrying. We're going to go up that way. Into there. You're going to come out of here. And go down there. Send some more people into there. And we'll send another coal train. And you're going that way. Three and a half minutes. You're going that way. And just on the off chance I have a problem with electricity, we'll send some more coal in that general direction. But now here are my canned foods being made. Shipping them out. There should be more than enough electricity to get me everything I need. And I've got three minutes. And I've got five bits of canned food left to make. And that should be absolutely everything done. Yes, I was overly... I overly predicted the demise of this area too soon. It happened at the 10 minute mark. Well, that happened at the 10 minute mark, that happened at the 13 minute mark. I'd have to check the timings on the video. Check the time in the top right hand corner against when the lavas, different lava pools came out. One more can good to make. Should be any second now. Which I will have done this with just under two minutes to spare. Which is not bad, all things considered. Yeehaw! Victory! The volcano! I did it in 16 minutes 11 seconds, didn't upgrade a train, and bought just with one train. That is how you get five stars on the volcano. Yes, if I hadn't tried it once already and had the lava come out and surprise me multiple times then I would have been completely lost so don't be surprised if you if you're doing this by yourself it takes you more than one attempt if you watch this video first then you've got a chance of knowing when things are going to occur okay well that was the volcano scenario in the globalization age of Train Valley 2. Next time around, it will be Frankfurt. I have no idea what Frankfurt is going to have in store for me because I've never looked at it yet up to this point. Now, as these get more complex, I may actually have to go into them and look at them before I actually record them because I have no idea how bad they're going to be or how complex or how long I'm going to have to sit there and stare at the screen thinking, how do I do this? But for the moment, I will continue to try and play and record them the very first time I've seen them. Because it's fun. For me, anyway. Might not be for you, but it is for me. And it's all about me. As always, I hope you enjoyed. And hope, or at least, hope, hope you found it useful. And the timings give you an idea of when you're going to be suffering from lava destroying everything that you 
built or was already pre-built for you. And hopefully I'll see you down the track for more Train Valley 2 in the future. Cheerio!